I forgot I had to do this. But yeah, we should really give that necklace back. And a scrap of paper. A circle on a date. Well. Hmm. Uh, what was the date? June 12th. Uh... Something... Not much help. Oh. I didn't even think to check that. So bye bye to the manager's keys. And is this the key we need to get into uh, that room? And save our friend finally? No, it isn't. Nice. Hmm. That was underwhelming. What the fuck door does this open then? There is one more locked door we could go into, which I think, because this is open now for some reason. Yes! Fucking finally. Whoa! Can I take the empty bucket? With the stone. Hmm. Well, that's... a bummer. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh! forth a piece of paper. Something is written on it. It is past closing time. Huh? We strictly observe the rules. I have called the police to the lobby. Uh-oh. A fake sword. You're the manager. Oh. Well, you... Now that I see you up close, you look all right. Suga-kun?
Hmm. Now, now. So that's Sakuma, eh? Grand Chip. Oh. Yeah, because the rest of my family's dead. What? Please go back. No can... Uh? Go back. Yeah. They really don't have anything. What? Hey, rude. No hotels. Of course not. Seems alright with everyone except for the fellow who owns the place. Or runs the place. He doesn't seem happy. Okay. Question. Yeah, they did kind of distance themselves from their relatives. Wait, isn't the rain when uh, the Kotorio, Kotorio Bake comes? Oh, so there's still some places the manager son won't let us into. I can't believe I just said that. Oh, that's a cone. Man, this place sure looks different in the light. Oh, we locked that place on us, did he? Drat. Oh. Like what? What do you always do here? Read and sleep. Nice. Well, I'm glad you got some peace here. Why don't you like me? Mochizuki.
<laughs> Don't you? True. Okay. Oops. I already talked to you about that. Tell me about the manager. A black telephone pole. That's not nice. He does seem a little strange. Intimidating? Hmm. How oh, mysterious. Manager. In rain, going out is X. Can we ask you about stuff? Quickly finish it, go back. Thank you for your hospitality. Oh, he's nothing more he wants to tell us. Sorry. Wait, so all those doc uh, strange documents we found in that that's the manager's room. All the strange documents we found in there was just him communicating. What? Yeah! Now we can explore more stuff. Can we still go out... here? Nope. Was a nice thought, but... New. New. Engage the key, motherfucker. One out toys. Bottle with shining bluish white in it. Do not go into the forest. Do not go into the forest. Because the Kotori Obake likes children. If you go into the forest alone, you will be eaten. Even if you are not alone. And then I'm making a promise with the Kotori Obake. You and your friends will have to do sad, painful things. Don't ever think that monsters don't exist. No matter how much adults say it doesn't exist, if you are a child, you will be eaten by the Kotori Obake. Hmm. Whoa. Is that the Kotori Obaki? Author, illustrator, Suga. Oh. Oh, so this is literally, literally a kid's room. For when you're exploring the mansion. There's a shiny. Incidents and stories. Things are mainly passed on through oral tradition. There are a few writings. Oh, there's lots of shinies here. Events of the past be forgotten disappear. Ah, the tale of the Kotori Obaki. To explain Cho's disappearances. Hmm. Questioning the legend. In the prefecture, Azakawa village was an old settlement, isolated from the mountain, in the mountains. Not convenient coming into the village. Few who came back or forth. Little farming. 
Hmm. Trade in crystals. Ooh. Stones of forgetfulness? We'll read about Ogami san, then we'll call it a video. Let's perform prayers. Adults. Hmm. A certain amount of maturation. The disappearance is only a matter of time. I wonder if Suga is the Ogami-san of this village. I think on that note, we'll find that out next time. Once I knew my way upstairs. I want to know what's in here. I can't find out what's in here. We'll explore this room and others next time. Until then, until then.